and James and I have been joined in the studio by my friend Wendy from Hong Kong. Hello, everyone. You're right. Hello. Yeah. So uh, they've just been jamming. Actually, the whole studio is like. You know, those, it's like, like that, Jules Holland in here. It is. It's amazing. You know that house that the Rolling Stones hired in the late sixties, and everyone just dropped in and just jammed, and that's where they got <laughs> the albums from. It's like that. Everyone's just sort of jamming and playing music. It's lovely. So uh, James has literally just learnt a song on the hoof, on the fly, uh, <laughs> and Wendy's been singing it in Cantonese. So we're going to do that after eight o'clock. Cool. Um, yeah. But first, what we do, James, for the uninitiated and for anyone out there who may not have heard this program before for, for some reason. I'm very nervous now. Amazing. Um, <laughs> yeah. And they're driving around their car thinking, what's going on here? Yep. We do a feature every week called Bristolian Cantonese. Okay. Where uh, my friend Wendy from Hong Kong teaches me Cantonese. Okay. Well, tries to teach me Cantonese. I have enough <laughs> no, trouble he, with English. He's a good student so far. <laughs> uh, so far. Um, and I teach her some useful, helpful Bristolian phrases and sayings. Okay. All right. So, um, cool. Wendy, if you go first, what, what's this week's lesson? I've, I, I, by the way, I can count from one to ten in Cantonese. Yeah, that's, that's, what, that's the first thing. Please, Amazing. James, do the on the right. count one to ten. For I've, us. I've been practicing. Hold on, Here I do go. need my piece of paper still, but I've been practicing. That's fine. All right, so <clears throat> <laughs> pressure, pressure. <laughs> this is oh, playing the guitar is nothing compared to this. Believe me. Right. Um, <clears throat> here we go. Ya yi sam se ng lo ta ba gao sub. Ah, okay. Okay. There's the Bristolian lessons helping. Okay. Yep. Is okay. that all right? Is that, is yeah. that sort of what I should be doing? Yeah, that's very good. Okay. Cool. Okay. Now, um. So, what have you got planned for this week? Okay, this week, yes. because I already knew that um, James, your mates were going to come today, so yes. I'm going to be easier for everyone. Thank you. Good. Okay. Um, <laughs> Just to start with this, is that in English language, uh, you guys borrow words from other languages. Yes. Right? Yes. Um, even in Chinese, okay? For example, tea. You know cup of tea? Yeah. That's Chinese, Chinese. actually. Kumquat yeah. is also Chinese. So what's that? Kumquat is a, it's a fruit. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah. 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 And amazingly... We're still speaking English and James... Yeah. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right, I've done it before. I did go to school. Okay. A couple of times. And the other one is ketchup. Oh, ketchup. No way. That's Chinese. Ketchup. Yeah, that's Chinese. Chinese. Down. No way. Yeah, that is Chinese. But what? It's what happened is, uh, well, basically it was created um, in China very long ago. It's a sauce that for shellfish and fish. And then, and then somehow Malaysia, they also got that. And then um, when English go to Malaysia, they... They, they just taste it very good. What was it? That was ketchup, and then you guys just picked it up and just called it ketchup. Oh, that's yeah. Wow, awesome I never knew that. Yeah. Oh, there we are. So, See, this um, show's here to educate as well as entertain. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, well, all right. It's, it's a good time that's to say I hate tomato ketchup, <laughs> but anyway, it doesn't matter. Okay, but um, to make you guys feel better, yes. okay, okay. <laughs> Cantonese also borrows words from other languages. Okay. I would say, especially. English and Japanese. Okay, yeah? so if there's no word for it in Cantonese, you just fill in with the English word. Exactly. Excellent. So, um, so obviously tonight we're going to concentrate on the English side of yes. things. So I start with a very short story, right? Okay. So let's say one day I wanted some um, salad, so I went to a shop to buy, uh, went to a shop by bus. When I got there. I bought myself some chocolate and strawberries as well. Okay. Now, in that story, mm -hmm. there were four words that um, we borrow it from English and make it into Cantonese. We've got to guess which ones. <laughs> oh, no, it's okay. I'll let the you. The word is you. Black. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so the first word um, is salad. Oh, really? Okay, okay. so okay. salad in Cantonese is salad. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it sounds like okay. salad, right? Okay. But salad. You've got the final letter, like you told us to do. Exactly. You okay. don't. You don't say the don't D. Don't say it. No. Nope. Yeah. Okay. So the next one is basi. <laughs> Careful. Basi. <laughs> basi. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. James, you speak very well. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Comes in here, showing off. <laughs> oh, yeah. What it is is bus. Bus. Yes. Bus. Okay. All right. Okay. So, okay. 
bus, so it's bus. I see. Okay. Uh -huh. right. Okay. So the third one is a lot of people would love it. It's Chugu Lake. Chugu Lake is chocolate. Oh, I see. Oh, so nice. you've kind of taken the Western same syllables. word and uh, yeah, it's just three. Chugu Lake. Chugu Lake. Chugu Lake. Yes. Okay. Yes. Chugu Lake. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, so it sounds like chocolate, isn't Just, it? How oh, I was saying, that's rubbish. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. That's great. I get this every week. <laughs> no, no, you guys <laughs> doing well. <laughs> okay, the last word is strawberry. Okay. 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 Well, that sounds just like what we say. Yeah. Okay. So no, no, that's West just English. <laughs> but I just wonder. I mean, now you know the salad, bus, and chocolate. Yes. I just wonder what you think it might be in Cantonese. Oh, we, we can only be offensive now. I was going to say. This is <laughs> no, not, not, to not to worry. Not to worry. I can see clocks only in the headlines coming out from this. I'm, you know, <laughs> this this can't end well. Uh, well, I suppose it would be something similar to strawberry. So straw. Berry? <laughs> not, not bad to tell. Oh, he's, he's played it diplomatic. I've played it very <laughs> diplomatic um, there, mate. Um, strawberry, something like that. So, break it up. Strawberry. Oh. So, it's Cito Belle. Oh, I see. Okay. <gasps> Cito Belle. Yeah, okay. that's it. Okay. So, how would you say that whole. Sorry, we're late for the news. So, how would you say that whole sentence in. Cantonese Whoa. with the English words in. Not me, you. Okay. You're of the Cantonese course, speaker. Of course. Yeah. I might better count to ten, but I can't do whole sentences yet. <laughs> okay. Um, Mao Yan, or San Hui. You see, I haven't prepared it. But uh, anyway, see, uh, not very good at translating. No, you're not okay. very good at speaking Cantonese. Can you speak Cantonese? Chinese? Are you? No. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Okay. But Mao Yan, I want to salad. Then I go to a restaurant. Then. 就坐坐巴士，咁当我到达嗰个嗰度嘅时候咧，我就诶顺、呃、便买埋朱古力同埋士多啤梨。Oh, round applause for that! Wow, wow! <laughs> Do you know what? I, I feel so incredibly untalented. You know, you're playing the guitar. She's speaking twelve different languages. You know, I, I really, seriously. Right. Well, that that was great. Thank you. I never knew you borrowed English words like yeah. that. Yeah. So, you don't borrow any of the Bristolian words we've learned. You don't. You don't borrow um, your tears or anything like that that we've we talked. No. Probably not. That's, that's my mission in life to get that. I think that. that's why you're teaching me Bristolian, right? Sure, sure. That's my mission in life to get that into Cantonese. I think if we can get the word. Trackner or something like that into <laughs> Cantonese, or um, what was it we learned the other week? Um, Chers and uh, um, yeah. Lush. If Lush, we can get yeah. those words into Cantonese, <laughs> mm. that'll be my life's ambition from now on. Right. Thank you very much, Wendy. We're late for the news. Oh, let's be fair, that was always going to happen, wasn't it? <laughs> um, so what we'll do is we'll come back and do the Bristolian element to this uh, on the other side of the news, if that's OK with everybody. Yeah. All right. Don't anybody go anywhere. Uh, I will find the news jingle, and then we will do the news. James Sayer is still with us. Windy is still with us as well. Windy, we need to finish off our language lessons mm -hmm. because we only did the the uh, Bristolian part. I didn't. Uh, sorry, we only did the Cantonese part. I didn't. I didn't follow through on the Bristolian part. So uh, let's see how we get on. Right. Um, what was I going to show? You? Oh yeah. Now, last week. <laughs> what did we talk about last week on um, Bristolian Cantonese? Lush. Lush, exactly. Now, have you been using this word as part of your homework? Because this I is a definite. I tried, word that we need to... but um... <laughs> it's difficult, isn't it? Yeah, it's it is, yeah. especially. I, what, what I have is a good taste gene that kicks in. I find I can't use it. You know, you start saying it, oh, you know, it just it which won't come out. You know, but um, um. So anyway, another useful word for your Bristolian. Mint. 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 M I N T. But as you know, the letter T in Bristolian is evil yeah. and must never be spoken. Yeah. So therefore, it becomes mint. Mint. Now, what do you think that means? It's can't. It can't be mint that from the. Front. It is, but it has a different meaning. Um. What mints? No. <laughs> mint. You know, last week we had lush. So I went out with this guy and he was really lush. Yeah. Right. Mint is 
Ed, I, I didn't. James is <laughs> no, laughing now. Say. Can I just say, I am married, right? Um, so I, I went out with this girl and she too, was I. lush. <laughs> Either way, I'm going to get in trouble with my wife. I'm going to get laughed at by you. Either way. Um, mint is excellent or very, very good. Right. So, we saw James Sarah play the guitar earlier and he was... Mint. Mint. He was absolutely oh. mint. Yeah. Now, you might preface this with well. Not well. Well. How to spell it? Well mint. Well he mint. Was well mint. Was it me? He? <laughs> he, was <laughs> he was well mint. She was well mint. <laughs> Whatever. Mint. All right. Now the other thing I need to show you as well is mint M I N T, and the other word to bear in mind is mind M I N D. Yep. If you want to emphasise something, you put the word mind in the end. Yeah. He was mint mind. Okay. He was mint Again, mind. she was mint mind. <laughs> okay. All right, so yeah. that's, that's, you know, try and take that away this week and, you know. Um, sure. I can't get there until eight, mind. Uh, oh, you're not right. just saying yeah. that you can't get there until eight o'clock. You're emphasising there is absolutely no possibility on God's earth that you'll be there before eight o'clock. All right, so it's all about emphasis. Okay. All right. I try because I find that, I, I heard a lot of people say mine. Yeah, there you are. Now but you know I why. just find that it's not natural for me to say that. So No, it's not I'll natural try. for anyone. But once you lived in Bristol a while, <laughs> don't worry, you'll be saying it all the time. All right. I'm late then. for work, mind. All right, it'll, just, it'll just come out naturally. It'll just flow. It'll just, you know, it'll just be there.